Hello YouTube. Today's video is how to connect your Google site web page to your Google domain name. Now from the get-go, everything appears super easy, but unless you follow these steps in order, you may run into some problems, which could explain why you're watching this video now. Uh, this is the 2021 version, and the only other thing to note is that this uh, does not apply to the Google uh, Workspace, formerly known as G Suite, so this is just for uh, folks with uh, regular Gmail addresses that have created their own little Google uh, websites. So the first thing you wanna do is head over to Google Domains, find the domain name that, uh, that you'll be using, make sure the used Google Domain Name Servers is set. Uh, you may have this enabled by default, which is just fine, leave it as that. And you should see nothing else. If you have any other records, go ahead and delete them. Head over to the Google site now that you've created. And once you're ready, go ahead and click Publish. Now you're gonna see this custom URL here. Don't touch it, okay? Uh, skip that for now. Go ahead and change this though. You most likely want the website you've created to be public. Done, okay, and we'll publish. All right, so super simple. Head back to Google Domains now, and we are going to click the little website button on the side. And although we already have a website, we're still going to click build a website. And then look for this at the bottom here, this simple site powered by Google Sites, continue, and we're using an existing site. All right, now what you see on the right side is the name of the site that you've created. Um, it already has matched them up, but uh, you may have it called something else, but either way, uh, this is the, um, the URL that uh, will be used. Keep this box checked and connect the site. That is it, okay? Uh, if you click your DNS settings, you will see that uh, it's going to um, give you an error. It, it, it's not, it's doing its thing. It will should be ready in about 20 or 30 minutes, be patient. Um, after it's ready, you can enable uh, the uh, extra security on there. And if this is a domain or a website you wanna kind of track the traffic on, you can head over to the Google Search Console and, uh, and put uh, the website in. Um, and the nice thing about this is it's all connected automatically. It's already verified and you can go to the property and check it out. So that is it. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Uh, just to give you a preview of what the settings will look like, again, do not touch them. Um, but it'll have specific numbers that are um, for for you. So that, that's where your files are stored. Um, you won't see anything here. You don't need to add anything here. Uh, I promise you just be patient, wait about 30 minutes. It says up to 24 hours, but it shouldn't be that fast um, and you'll be good to go. So uh, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Hope I was able to help.